Winter yeah. temperatures are coming back, but we have had a lot of warm ups lately. Yeah, and that's been the problem. That's caused some premature blooming across the south. Next week, though, we go back to warmth for some spots, especially in the central yeah. United States, the northeast, and even a little bit in the south. But while some of you are enjoying the mild temperatures, it may be causing a little confusion yes. in our yards. Kara Ziegler with Peg Nurseries is live to discuss what to do if your plants are blooming early. Thanks for being with us this morning. So we're going to start off with the warm and rainy weather, causing some weeds to pop up. That's right. So that's, what do we do about that? That's the problem when it does get warm is the weeds start to germinate. So the first thing you want to do is go ahead and get a pre-emergent out. A pre-emergent or and a post-emergent, you put that out. It doesn't matter if we're having a lot of rain because it needs to be watered in. Right. And that will keep the weed seeds from germinating and it also will kill the weeds that are coming up right now. All right, good stuff. We've got three plants here, which are beautiful plants. Uh, some of these should be blooming this time of the year. Some of them should not. Which which one doesn't belong, or which two don't belong? Let's, the let's put it the Laura Petalum here does not belong. This is a good four to six weeks before it really should wow. be blooming, and this azalea as well. We are two months out for that. Okay, so what we have underneath here though, because that cold air is coming back. I know Jim showed the warmth, but we still have all of February to get through and March right, as well. Right. Uh, how well do these cloths work opposed to plastic or what is the best thing to do to protect our plants? You when need it's cold? to do the, the, the cloth for sure. So okay. you want to put the cloth down. So if, if there is a hard freeze in the forecast, you want to cover everything with that frost cloth. You could do a sheet if you wanted to. You don't want to do plastic. Plastic will really damage the plant. And you want to go ahead and put it out when before the sun goes down so you can trap that Heat, warmth yeah. underneath the frost cloth and then you want to be sure to remove it as soon as the sun comes out the next day. In between all of our warmth that we've been talking about this mm -hmm. stuff, we had that cold snap, that snow, that wind mm -hmm. really zapped a lot of the pansies. What can people do to kind of bring those back to life? Go ahead and start fertilizing them. Now's a really? great okay. time to go ahead and put some osmocotes, some pansy food, and you want to hit them hard with the fertilizer over the next few weeks. And if it stays dry, you've got to water that too. You've got to water them. As soon as you fertilize them, you want to water it in really well. Water your pansies in really well. And if we're expecting a frost or a hard freeze, you want to water all of your plant material really well because water insulates the plant. Oh, right. I was going to say, you're, you're not going to freeze out your plant if you water it. It's the same thing as in Florida when they spray the uh, fruit with the water exactly. and cases the uh, plant. That's exactly right. So you right. do that to the roots or do you do that on top of the plants to encase the leaves and whatnot? It actually helps the foliage too. If you go ahead, if we're going to have a hard freeze, it's better for them to have the ice on the leaves right. and to spray them down because that insulates them and that right. helps tremendously. Same thing strawberries. Uh, Winter Daphne here, by the way, one of my favorites, very fragrant. That's Even one of you my said favorites. it smelled up the whole car. So uh, anyway, just a little better that smell than the, the other type of smell that yeah. smell up the whole car. <laughs> Jen. Gym bag. I, I have a feeling that plant's going to be the backseat of Jim's car before this is over. I just know how he operates.